Hey everybody, Zach here at eTrailer.com. Today we're taking a look at a K-Source Universal Towing Mirror on our 2020 Chevrolet Tahoe. When it comes to hauling trailers, whether you're hauling a boat like we have here today or a camper behind us, it's important to see when you're changing lanes, whenever you're trying to back up and maneuver around. And the factory mirrors just don't give us that good a field of view. They're really designed for just your vehicle, not having an additional you know, 20 feet behind you. So being able to see whenever we're changing lanes at highway speeds is extremely important. And these are gonna do a good job of that. Here I am at the back of the trailer. Now you can see me just fine in the factory mirror, but as I step out into a different lane, you can see this yellow line simulates a lane change there. As I get a little bit further out to maybe where the car next to you that's hanging out in a traditional blind spot, you lost me in that factory mirror, but you picked me up in the towing mirror. So we're getting a much wider field there so we can safely change lanes. If somebody's hanging out in that blind spot, you don't really have to worry about, you know, turning around, checking to see if somebody's there. You get a much better look to see where people are at. So pairing that with the passenger side is gonna be even more wider field of view so you can change lanes comfortably as you're going down the highway. Now what I like about these is we have a lot of versatility on the angle that we're gonna view. So when we were just looking at seeing into another lane, I had this in this vertical position. So this gives us a higher field of view whenever we're maybe backing into a low clearance area, but we can easily spin this. And I say easily, I can do it, but it took a little bit of effort. So it's not something you're gonna to wanna to do going down the highway really but we want that to kind of be tight there too so it's not moving all around when we're going down the highway. So being able to rotate that to get exactly what we're looking for out of our viewing angle and then being able to you know, bring this in a little bit, tilt it up and down. We've got full 360 motion there to give us that perfect viewing angle whenever we're driving down the road. These mirrors do a great job of giving us you know, a wider viewing angle, but one thing that I think they have a drawback on is they're universal. So it's nice that we can swap these out with different vehicles, but we don't get that custom fit that maybe you're looking for. So they fit on here, they're gonna stay on here when we're going down the road, but they're gonna vibrate a little bit. And I personally don't care for the way these fit because you can see there's a little bit of movement there. I have these about as tight as they can get, but just the way the mirror's designed on that angle, they're gonna slide around a little bit. Now this isn't coming off, but it's just gonna add to that vibration that we're gonna get when we're going down the road. Another thing that these mirrors are gonna do is they're gonna partially block our puddle lamps if your vehicle's equipped with those. So maybe turn signals, things like that. The universal mirrors don't really consider those features because they're intended to fit a lot of vehicles. So if you're worried about covering up turn signals and puddle lamps, you might wanna look at some of the custom fit options. Something I do like is how we can adjust these. So we have the ability to make them a little bit tighter. I like that it has this kind of ratcheting mechanism in there to give us a tighter fit. And then if you're worried about harming the finish of your vehicle, they have these really nice rubber pads where most of the pressure is being applied. Everything else here is gonna be rubber coated. Now, we do have some plastic up here that may scratch it. Um, so that's definitely something to be mindful of when you're putting these on. One thing that some people have noted is that they like that this can fold in. So if you're street parking, you know, this is gonna stick out even further and we don't have any contact with our Tahoe today with having these folded in. So that's a nice feature. And then we still have full adjustment of our factory mirror. So it looks like it's really close, but the way this is designed, it's not gonna interfere with being able to adjust our mirror to help give us a better view with this mirror as well. If you only need one, you can pick this up as a single, but I would advise buying the pair because I think it's just as important as having a passenger side mirror whenever you're changing lanes. It's relatively simple to install, so let's just show you how we put this one in place. To get these installed, you wanna make sure that you have the straps on there. So they just hook in to these little tabs that are sticking out. You can see just like that. And you wanna make sure that when you're doing the levers there that they open up towards the top. So if you're doing the other side, you wanna make sure that they're turned around the right way. So then we're gonna take these little teeth right here and get those to fit in between the actual mirror and the housing of the mirror. Get that lined up properly. I 
then we can get these to hook in place the same way we did up top and you can see there's a lot of slack in place there on this side so what we need to do is just get those tightened down them hooked back in place and this one's actually in a good spot here it was just this one here so you can pull a little bit through open that up and then you can just ratchet those down close those up and then I like to tuck this excess down in there if possible. It's a little tight. We'll just get it tucked away so it's not flapping around. And then make sure that we've got it in place all the way. And then we can just repeat that same process for the other side if you pick up the pair. You can see it didn't take a lot of time. Might need to make a slight adjustment there. So to loosen them up to make that adjustment we'll just take that top one there. We'll just press that and we can kind of feed that through there. Then I'm just going to bring this in a little bit more and then we can ratchet that down. So that gives us a much better fit than what I originally had. And it slides a little bit more. You just want to make sure that you've got that pushed in as far as they'll go. And that's one of the drawbacks to these style mirrors. They just sometimes don't quite sit in there the way a custom fit mirror would. But the installation is definitely, it doesn't take a long time to do the opposite side mirror, the passenger side. You would just repeat that same process. You would just flip those straps around the opposite way. So I think that the custom fit is definitely the way to go, especially if you're using it all the time. You're not gonna have as many vibrations. The installation, in my opinion, it sits on there a little bit better, but these are still gonna do a really good job. I think that when it's all said and done, you want a mirror that's gonna give you good wide field view so it's safe to change lanes, and these are gonna do a good job. But that's going to do it for a look at the K-Source Universal Towing Mirrors on our 2020 Chevrolet Tahoe.